Hello everyone, this is H.U.S. Husky here, and uh, I'm here with some Victor really quickly. What's going on, man? Hey, what's up, Husky? It's your turn to ban, and we have to take away champions that we don't want anyone playing. Oh, God, who should I ban? Uh, well, we really don't want to be playing against, like, Fiddlesticks or... Yeah, Fiddlesticks would be my first choice for ban here, and they're going to ban, and then you get to ban another one, so... Uh... I'm th trying to think of champions. Heimerdinger would, would be pretty scary. Akali would also be pretty bad. So I would say Akali would be a, a good choice for a ban here. And then uh, lastly and not leastly, phew, I don't I don't know I don't know who I'd pick as the third ban. God, if only I could just ban everyone and they didn't get a go against. Uh, <laughs> wait, did they not ban someone? Is that uh, okay? They yeah, banned they, Annie, which is good. I I'm really bad at Annie, so that's good for us. Uh, let's see. I definitely would ban uh, he Heimerdinger would be would be quite scary. Akali would be pretty uh, pretty intense. Um, Ari as well would be pretty bad. There's a lot of I mean in the in the showdown it's two v two, so we've got a lot of choices. All right. Well, uh, I apparently I accidentally clicked Darius, so that's who we get. <laughs> no Darius. No Darius. No, no Darius for anybody. They can't actually see them anyway. I know, I know. It's fine. It's <laughs> fine. That uh, that text is for a chat. Uh, really, what I what I was trying to say this whole time. This is why I got distracted. Is there is a new mode that uh, is currently? Wait, is this? Do am oh, I banning another one? Oh my Ash. god. Yeah, this is this is the last ban for us. So it's because I spelled three. Ari wrong. That's what happens. Uh, they did ban Ash, which makes me really, ban really Akali. sad. Ban Akali. Akali would be pretty bad, I think. You think so? We're, we are showing our newbiness by not knowing, like, we're probably missing the most obvious. But, yeah, Kali would be pretty awful. Yeah, we're banning all the melee characters, man. They, they, we're, we're let, oh, they banned Teemo. All right. They insta ban Teemo. Okay, yeah, so it's they my were, turn to pick. All right. Uh, well, I got to, I, I got to go tried and true. I think, uh, I think my boy Jarvan is going to be, uh, is going to be pretty useful in here. I'm going to be building for tank, so, yeah. That's oh, God, I'm who should I pick? They don't give you any time. Uh... Pick, uh, well, you like your Caitlyn. And She's all right. You like We're going to go with Graves. We're going Graves. Yeah, Graves would be good. So we got Kale and Shin Zhao. Uh, Kale was probably going to be a pretty decent choice here as well. Now, uh, as Husky was talking about, this is the brand new game mode here in League of Legends called the Snowdown Showdown. And we are doing, of course, the 2v2 queue. There's also a 1v1 queue. It's basically 2v2 on, in the one lane map, which is called Howling Abyss. You may also know it as ARAM uh, for the ARAM games. And I think it's just a, it's just straight up 2v2. And whoever... Whoever Nexus's die loses, I think, anyway. This is going to be the, actually the first time me and Husky have ever even seen this mode. At least for me. I don't know about you, Husky. Yeah, no, I haven't. I haven't clicked it at all. I just started hitting recording. Uh, or, I just started by hitting record, and I was like, oh, God, we have to pick these things in, like, 10 seconds. I was not prepared uh, at all for that. So that's why that was kind of lulzy. But, uh, yeah, uh, Riot's been doing these kind of fun modes very, very sporadically and for very a very short amount of time. I think the last one was only, like, a week or something like that, uh, which was a lot of fun. That was kind of the mono battles version so this is gonna be my first time playing this i don't even know how much gold you start with i don't know what the countdowns i don't know if there's minions i i don't know it's gonna yeah. be interesting obviously i didn't know about the banning because that could have gone a little <laughs> bit better but uh really i don't think i would have banned the two champions they picked anyway so i feel like uh we're, we're just fine there but i i have no idea how this is gonna shape up i don't know what the balance of this is like at all so i have no experience this is gonna be we're, we are gonna be 2v2 virgins invicta yeah, I, uh, I I did read a little bit about it uh, when it was first released. I know that Riot has been doing these seasonal event game modes, like the all-for-one or one-for-all uh, mode. That one lasted not not too long here. Um, but the, the showdown, snowdown, whatever it's called mode, is supposed to be lasting, I think, till the early part of next year, so like maybe two weeks from now. Uh, as far as balance is concerned, I have no idea. Kale is going to be a little bit of trouble. And I like how they kind of... Uh, they kind of sneakily made a Poro reference with that uh, with that middle icon there. We got <laughs> that, that. It's a it's like a horde Poro almost. That's what mm. that's what it looks like to me anyway. Yeah, no, I'm seeing that now. It's got the horns. The uh, the banner's kind of a tongue. Yeah, am I, yeah, it's, am I it's a Cyclops part? Poro, I think. There we go. I like it. I will say that the new Lulu skin is actually pretty awesome. Uh, is, is it Pix is now a flying Poro? All right, so we are yep. level one and we only get a little bit of gold. They recommend that I get Duran's Blade, which I guess I could do. Uh, yeah, Duran's Blade would be pretty nice. Uh, oh, oh, and we do start at level one. Okay. So, but Duran's Blade would give you some sustainability there. Um, I feel like 
Oh, wow, oh they God, actually... She actually said slow down, show down. That was... That kind of turned me on a little bit. Oh, did she really? I wasn't even paying attention. Uh, let me see here. Yeah, this is this is just a straight up two v two. Husky already talking about the best bands. Now, one thing that uh, that subscribers here on my on my channel will notice is that I actually have all chat turned on for the Maybe very very ever swung. first time. Uh, so now I can see everyone talking trash in all chat. Oh, see, alone. but trash talking is the best part of online gaming. And it's not even doing the trash talking. It's just watching other people attempt to trash talk, which I find to be uh, I find to be hilarious. I don't know if they're in the bushes, by the way. I, I did not check that for us. And they Definitely. were actually. They were actually I, over there. So I face-checked it. But, uh, yeah, here know. we go. I think, Husky, are we even going to worry about CS? I mean, Oh, yeah. Gonna... Oh, yeah, no, for sure. For sure. I think CS is... Uh, is actually gonna be important because I mean those meters were twenty, and oh, well, well I mean in the sense like do you want me like giving you the CS? Oh no, you should since I'm so bad you should try and go for whatever you can because gotcha. I again I don't know what the balance is like should you feed me or is it good to be more equal? <laughs> I I have no idea and people can be like oh husky how do you not know the uh, the lead is strat I don't know I've never played it before so <laughs> you know what you know what just just do what you want. That's, that's all I'm saying. And actually, no one has played this because it's a brand new freaking game mode. Oh, no. There's someone out there who's already played 100 games. We already we already oh. know that to be the case. It was probably Kurt. Kurt's already played 100 Kurt games. Kurt plays a lot of this game. Oh, my <laughs> God. He's getting really good. We sh Like, he found out about it way after us, and I feel like he's way better at it than us. Like, he, he's already uh, he's already GM. Yeah, homie's freaking try hard, man. What does this do after? Okay, tax speed for four seconds. Okay. I forgot what happens after you dash. It's it's been a while since I have played my man Graves. Uh, I love him a lot, but they kind of banned Ash. I was hoping for Ash, but yeah, uh, they kind of banned. I can see how himself. Ash would be a problem here. Yeah, Ash would be amazing. I we probably should have banned Ash and not had the uh, silliness. Uh, you ain't actually Husky. All right. Well, thanks for thanks for letting me know that. Uh, this whole oh, time wow. I thought you're, that I was, which is I thought you were. I'm I gonna know. take this so they can. I also there is the uh, the full health uh, upgrades, which is kind of interesting considering. There's only two people, so that's those health upgrades are probably super important. Yeah. Uh, so, are we gonna consider this part a try hard? I mean, I don't understand. Oh, it looks like they're actually going for Husky right now. Shinzao doing a lot of damage on Graves, yeah, but that is not gonna yeah. work. First blood goes to H to the Husky. Husky. Rocking and grab the health. Man. Actually, it looks like there's only two health packs. Uh, so I'm trying to learn this as like as it's happening. But yeah, there's only two health packs, so they're super important. So as long as we can keep the. Uh, can't keep the health pack control, I guess. Oh, oh, I forgot Kale is ranged. Oh, they're trying to kill me. Trying to kill me. Finish him. Finish Get him. Out of there. Get out of there. Finish him. Yes. Oh, we um, win. Is that it? Is that? <laughs> is that? Is that? <laughs> oh my god. I, I did. <laughs> <laughs> All right, our lead strategy worked out perfectly, Sinvicta. Oh my god. Where did these poros come from? Oh my god. Uh, report Kale for being. I didn't even know that it was only one round. LOL. Oh my god. So I don't know that going for Duran's blade is uh, is the way to go. Oh, I mean, it's like okay. Oh my god. I did not expect that at all. When they said GG, I thought I was like, okay, well, surely like they're like Shin's house gonna come back. Apparently, it's a permanent, it's a death match. It's just a straight up death match. All right, well, we gotta we gotta at least do one more. Now that we oh now that we know God. what's going on, uh, and we're probably gonna lose now because we actually understand uh, what's happening yeah. here. We need to stay blissfully uh, ignorant to the to how to play this. So so yeah, so that's it. And um, Riot is also. They award uh, custom avatars for your summoner icon whenever uh, whenever you queue up and win. I think you only need three wins, and you get the uh, the packaged Poro or the present Poro, something mm. like that. It, it's the one that Ro really, really wants, and uh, that means that she's going to have to queue up for one of these eventually. Which that'll be that'll be hilarious. Uh, I think Kurt's been playing all this as well. All right, all right, we're gonna ban Ash right away. No Ash for you. I feel like that's a slightly better ban than last time. Uh, yeah. And I, again, I still feel that Akali would be pretty. Uh, Annie, Annie is pretty scary. That that was a pretty good ban by them. Uh, you basically just have to think of champions you would not want to play up, play against. You know who'd be awful would be Ziggs. Mm. I just remembered that. If you think about, if you think about champions who are absolutely terrifying in Aram. Uh, what about Ziggs Jinx? Would, Should I get rid of Jinx? 
Yeah, Jinx would be a pretty she'd be pretty ter terrifying to go after or go up against as well, I think. All right, guys, let's know down below who should we actually be banning because we have absolutely no idea. <laughs> no idea. We, we like to pretend that we do, but we don't. We really don't. So we'll, we'll get rid of Jinx there. Uh, they got rid of Master Yi. I could see why they would get rid of Master Yi. There's I, Annie, I so Annie is gone again. Nobody likes Annie. Oh, and it bans it for both teams. Interesting. Yep. Um, I it's mean, basically like LTS setup. It's you know, once once a once a character is banned, it's a it's a global ban for both teams. So yeah, right on. I wonder if I should uh, get rid of. I'm probably just gonna do Caitlyn because I don't I don't even know. I'm getting rid of Caitlyn. Yeah, that's that's fine with me. That is fine with me, and uh, it, it seems like the range the range characters would have a pretty substantial. Uh, I, I don't want to call it an advantage, but I, I guess an easier time. Let's put it that way. Yeah, for sure. I mean, especially since if you think of Aram, like melee characters. All right, uh, who are we going for, by the way? Uh, well, I mean, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. All right, let's try it. Let's make it happen. You go uh, Graves again. <laughs> maybe. I wonder if I should do Flash or my Bubble. I wonder if Bubble's better. Barrier's super. Yeah, you don't. You're you're gonna want Barrier because you you could have survived and and easily face tanked uh, Kale there. At the end, so I would definitely say Barrier. Flash is Flash is good. I don't. I doubt you're gonna need heal. Um, well, but too barrier, late because I've got it. All right, well, we've, we've got it. And who are we going up against here? It's going to be, oh, God, Heimer and Oriana. Ooh. Yikes. Ooh, they're out for blood. They, uh, I, I'll just give them a victory right out the gate. But at least now we know not to get too crazy with it. Uh, oh well, I God, feel like so now I, I don't, I don't, I'm kind of scared that we're going to play too complacent, like too passive almost. Because it's like, you're dead, you're dead. And I also apparently... like how I was farming hardcore and my creep score was, like, really good. And that actually doesn't do anything because you can never spend the money. <laughs> yeah, like, it's, oh my god, it's just so weird. It's it's kind of cool, though. I, I like the, it's it's almost like a WoW arena in a way. And, and yeah, I said WoW in a, in a LOL video. But, I mean, honestly, in arena and WoW, like, once you die, that's it. You're dead. You you can be res technically. But you know what I'm talking about. It's, it's deathmatch style. And I think that's really cool. Um it's a neat concept uh, for for League of Legends. Yeah, it's definitely a ton of fun. Uh, I think it adds a lot of strategy because, like, a character like, uh, say, Caitlyn, like, she has a reason to attack creeps because she'll get her uh, crit chance that she could later use on. Graves doesn't really have a reason to uh, just because he doesn't get a major benefit from it, but... I, I guess mean, if you have Duran's Blade, you want to heal a little bit. I don't yeah, know. I was going to say, that's about the only reason why you'd ever want to try to get a CS on this on this version. So, and there you do, you see Heimerdinger, there's the gift-wrapped Poro. Uh, oh, that is a, oh my god. Yeah, it's sickeningly cute, and I really want it bad. So, and there's the TPA uh, uh, Oriana skin. That's another one that, that they just, uh, they recently resurrected. You can get that as part of, I think, the mystery gift, but I'm not quite sure. Uh, don't quote me on that. But either way, it's going to be pretty interesting with Orion and Heimer. Now, the one thing going for us is that we have huge initiation with me, uh, but I'm not going to be able to really go do much until I hit level two, where I can have the uh, the Dragon Strike into the Damascian Standard. They're basically the one where I throw the flag down and then pull myself to it. Well, it's going to be uh, tough because Orion is ranged, Heimerdinger's ranged, and Orion also has her bubble, which I feel like is going to be really good. Yeah, uh, it's... If I can get, if I can, as long as we don't let the turrets pick away at us too much, I think we'll be semi okay. We'll just have to let the creep wave eat the turrets. That's the only thing I can really think of. But uh, yeah, don't, don't, don't quote me on that. <laughs> Let's see. So I guess I can go for that. I'm wondering Welcome what the best items are the for this. Showdown. Anything with health regen. I'm, I'm just going straight for door and shield, and I get a mana pot. Um, because that seems like, to me anyway, anything with health regen would be huge. And I don't think you can buy as when, when as soon as you go forward, you can't go back and buy. Like, can you can you see real quick if you can go back into the store and, and access it? That's a good question. I'm going back right now. I mean, on ARAM you can't. I don't know if this is right. different or not. Well, it lets me open it. I don't know if I can buy anything though, because I don't have any money. Oh, that, I guess that's true. Wait, I could try selling. No, it doesn't. Wait. No, don't yeah, sell it does it. let me sell it. I wasted a pot, which was super stupid, but it let me sell it, so I think you can actually go back. Okay, well... Unless well, we'll I'm tripping, because to... I don't think you can do that at ARAM. I don't think you can go back and sell stuff. Uh, Honestly, I've never even I've never even thought about that. So I, I may have sacrificed that, but we're doing it for the betterment of the team right. in the long haul. 
Right, we've so, got, we've, so I'm, I'm still going to try and last hit. I, I feel like we can go back if we want to. Yeah, I've got enough gold right now. I I'm afraid of leaving you here, though, but... Knowing knowing if we can buy would be actually pretty huge. And there's Orianna's uh, ball, which looks like a, a Super Mario Brothers bomb there for a little bit. It does look pretty cool. I gotta admit, that skin is pretty dope. Yeah, that's the Ori skin that I want really, really bad. And it's it's not available for, for normal play. Um, it's a legacy skin. And every now and then, what's neat about Riot is that they do these these little throwback events that do feature the uh, the legacy skins that you can't you can no longer usually get. So it's definitely a skin. All right, I'm at level two right now, so I can I can initiate, but but watch out for both of these turrets over here. Yeah, they uh, I'm able to hit both of them, but they're both able to hit me, so that kind of sucks. So I do get I'm hit by. Dingy. Yeah, I do get hit by by Heimer's uh, turret there, but I did, as you saw there, I barely scratched him, and I did a ton of damage. So I feel like the next time, all right. So his his turret just went off, and I really, if I have if I have level three, I think when I hit level three, that's that's our that's our cue to go. All right, wish we could have oh, got that health. Got health. That's okay. That's yeah. okay. Also, a health pot would have been nice. Gonna gonna be honest about that. <laughs> I can't actually see Oriana's ball because it's being blocked by the turret right now. There it is. This is tense, man. All right, so level three. They've got level three as well. I wonder Which if I should timers... get the blinding cloud or I should get my buckshot. I feel like I'm gonna go uh, for the cloud because it's yeah, basically blinding... one fight and then it's over. Yeah, that it's yeah, that's pretty much it. I think if they destroy our turret, um, they might win as well. I don't oh. don't quote me on that though. But if it's anything like one v one mid, uh, one of the one of the standard rules is if they if they destroy a turret, of interesting. The game. So well, is by himself, but there's three turrets there, and yeah. the I feel like the longer or the the higher in level they get, the more powerful. They get comparatively speaking to us. Ooh, well, I'm, gonna gonna go, I'm gonna go try and buy just to okay, see. Okay, okay. I have 500 gold. I could get a Duran's blade. I feel like if you could buy, these two would also would have gone back a little bit. I don't know that though. I definitely can buy. Okay. Interesting. Just gotta make sure they don't kill the tower. Cause yeah, I think you might you might be right. We might lose the tower. <laughs> Well, I'm trying, I think I think buying is like such a risk that most people aren't gonna do it. Like I, I don't know that me going and buying was actually the right choice. Okay, yeah. So it's definitely it is definitely if you lose the turret, the game is over because there's never been a a uh, a notice like that. So we've got to go in here, Husky. Dude, I'm cool with it. I'm cool with All it. All right, I'm going on. I'm going on Heimer. Here we go. One battle to rule them all. I'm gonna pop my barrier, see if I can catch Heimerdinger. He's running all the way back to the turret. And I'm going to turn around and see if oh I can God, get Oh, God, I'm so dead. I'm so dead. <laughs> no. The Hyper Dinghy. The Hyper Dinghy is too strong. No. I don't know if I, I – I'm pretty sure I don't have enough time to go back and buy. And Wait, why, why oh, did I res? You're, you're resed. I'm back. I'm back, guys. I don't know why, but I'm back. Is it? Is it if both teammates are dead at the same time? Maybe. Oh, God, the tower. I'm trying, Husky. I'm trying. Oh, it didn't stun him. I'm so sad about that. Well, my attack doesn't stun him. Oh. Oriana's got me. No. Oh, is it if you both, like, if one dies, you both can die once? I Like, after you I, both honestly, have died no once, then it's over? Is that? That that seems like it because, I mean, you rezzed, so. All right. That, that, that's what I'm guessing. I, I'm guessing it's it's. Once everyone dies once. All right, well, we're gonna try one more just to see. We're we're slowly we're slowly learning the rules ourselves. I think it is if you lose your tower, you lose. If you each die once, you lose. Okay. I guess. So. So I think I'm going to switch it up instead of Jarvan. I'm going to play a champion as long as he doesn't get banned. Um, a champion that you have never seen me play, but I've been practicing a lot actually. And that champion. Well, I'll, I'll, I'll leave it as a, as a surprise for you. I'll wait to see if it gets banned first. All right, all right. Uh, their team is currently banning. All right, one out of six. Uh, apparently, they're an honorable opponents. Humble in victory, graceful in defeat. 
Oh yeah, they got the little red gem. I, I'm I'm still trying to get one of those. Let us let us know down below if uh, if anyone knows the requirements out of that. And they banned Sivir here for their first All ban. Right. Uh, I feel like I should ban Blitzcrank. Doesn't he seem like he'd be so annoying? Oh god, yeah, Blitz Blitzcrank Annie. I mean, if you want, you could try to risk going for Ash since that's your bread and butter. Uh, Malphite wouldn't be too bad except you'd be lacking in damage. So out goes Caitlyn. I'm not too worried about Annie. I feel like she's not that good in the early. That's stun, though. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna get rid of Jinx for now. Let's see, they've been they've had a couple really quick bans here. I'm trying to think of who. I think that's a good call on the Blitzcrank because I I would have never even thought about that. God, that'd be so annoying. All right, they Syra. got Syra. Wow. Trying to think of who for the last one. Maybe Lucian? We haven't seen... I don't... Hmm. Yi oh. would be pretty bad, but not terrible. Uh, Kate, uh, 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 Katarina would be pretty awful. Yeah, okay. I'm just going to go... I'm going to pick Ash. All right, there's the there's the man. All right, are we doing this? We doing Mr. And, Gambit yep. and uh, and Rogue. Ash, <laughs> Gambit and Rogue. I only say Rogue because she has white hair, not because she has ice and stuff. Because that would be Storm. I'm All that right, earth. we'll uh we'll we'll go with this. We'll see right. how this goes. And there's Annie. Oh, and Malzahar. Ugh. Interesting. Well, let let us now now YouTube. You heard it first. You heard Husky say, "I'm not too worried about Annie." So... We better we better destroy Annie <laughs> just so I can revel in my victory. I'm 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 just saying. I'm not saying, but I'm just saying. I'm that... gonna laugh though if Annie completely blows you up. That's gonna be <laughs> that's gonna be my favorite part. Of... I think my favorite part of the video though is the fact that it ended like right away and we were not expecting that. At yeah, we all. were like, all right, all right, now we got to go back and we got first blood and all of a sudden an explosion of poros come out, a poro explosion. And then, uh, and then me and Husky just laugh for the next ten minutes. They did have so, pretty good bands too. Like I could see those three being really good. Sivir would be pretty terrifying. I'm not too sure about the about the Caitlyn one because honestly, Caitlyn's only scary with her with her alt. Um, and then I don't remember who they banned the, uh, the third. Oh, Zyra. Zyra. I don't know. Zyra is my girl, but I don't trust her survivability on this map. Not well, at least not in this mode. Let's put it that way. Dude, that's a really cool hat, bro. You look really cool in that hat. Hey, I look fabulous. It's magnificent, okay? Nice. Uh, uh, we do have we do have Panda Annie and Overlord Malzahar. I mean, really, who has Malzahar skins? Apparently this guy. <laughs> he's like he mains his Malzahar. He's gonna he's gonna like two V one us right now. Or one V two us, I guess, technically. For Lord Ash, they're showing the junk in the trunk. I know, man. I don't know why she thought that'd be good combat clothes, but <laughs> Apparently she did. All right, so this is going to be interesting. I'm, I, I'm actually a little confident in my TFing ability. I, I've been, I've been doing pretty well with the, uh, uh, with TF here. To the snowdown showdown. The snowdown showdown. showdown. All right, well I'm going to go for a Duran's blade again. Uh, let us know down below, guys. What item should we actually be buying? Because like we said, we've never played this version before at all. And uh, I'm, I'm curious. Like, what are good champions? Who should we be banning? And what item should we get? Because I have no idea. This, you this... all are, you're literally seeing the first time we've ever played this. That that first game, game one, was the first time Husky and I have ever seen this mode. So, um, I've got a, I have a level one stun. So I mean, so will Annie, but but she has to work towards it, right? Don't you get it a lot easier? Yep, I just have to draw the gold card, and that's uh, usually pretty easy for me. Not to brag or anything, but I'm really good at drawing gold cards. <laughs> Well, here we go. It's going to be Malzahar and Annie taking on TF and Ash. Who would have thought? I wonder if with uh, Ash, if I should just save up my crit and then try and shoot them once. Because I yeah, wonder if ki killing the minions is worth it at all. I mean, I can stun them, so... It's going to come down to me stunning Annie before she can stun one of us, if that makes sense. Oh, it does. It does. Yeah, right. I kind of like this. It's like a whole new level of uh, of strategy because it does it really does kind of feel like a WoW arena. Here comes a stun from Annie and Hus Husky lighting Annie up. Yep. Good lord. She might run all the way back to spawn after that. Watch out yeah, for that I dot. Think, I think I'm just gonna wait for the uh, I'm gonna wait for the crit and I'm gonna use multi shot a lot. 
that uh, that purple field that you saw around uh, Malzahar, or around the mob that Malzahar was attacking, that will actually spread when it kills something. Oh. So be very, very cautious when you see one of our creep uh, surrounded by that aura. We should definitely be zoning him here, try to take control of the health regen when it, when it pops. Yeah, that's a good point. There's Annie again. She's back up to full HP-ish. Well, I'm, I'm level 2, and I can do some heavy poking. As you do see there, nice. I do clip I think Annie. actually hit them. Yeah, they hit both of them there, so... I'm ready when you are, Asgat. Go in and just stun him. And, uh, let's uh, wait, for my, uh, wait for my multi. Okay. And we're, we're going to go for oh, Annie. Grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it. So am I supposed to stay away from you when I have this dot? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There okay. you go. So it went off. It only spreads if it kills them. If it oh, kills if it kills them. Okay. Yeah, I remember yeah. playing Malzahar. I forget what he does. All right, I almost have my crit and my multi again. Okay. I and am. I'm going to turn on my frost arrow. All right, I'm ready to tango. All right. Let's, Annie does have her active stun, so be super cautious of that. Um, I actually outrange Annie with my stun, so... Aw, oh, I whiffed it. It was a whiffer. Right, I think I'm not I'm not going to get a uh, stacked deck, because I don't feel like that passive is going to help me here. Oh, that almost oh. so close to hitting them. So Annie is obviously saving up her stun here. Uh-oh. She's going to work on Husky. I'm going to see if I can get Annie here. I do stun her. And I think I might get a kill here, Husky. Oh, no, she's going to get away. Watch it, watch oh, it. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. I stunned him. I stunned him. Oh, man, that was so close. That was bad news bears right there. I'm going to see if I can I'm gonna see if I can grab their health before they can. I got it. Annie's actually missing, Husky. Malzahar's super close. No. <laughs> kill him. <laughs> There's oh, you're no super, way. you're really low too. Uh. All right, well, I can at least grab the health over here. All right, I'm gonna Annie's grab boots. super god. She is definitely purchasing something. Yeah, I'm. I'm gonna grab boots of speed. All you have to do, or not boots of speed, uh, second Dorn's ring. Just stay alive. I think it's. I don't know if it's first to two. It could also be first to two if you think about it. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. But yeah, I Annie's do have a back. She is at full health. I feel like you should go back and uh, because they're not gonna be able to kill our tower, so go yeah. back and buy like a couple health pots. Yeah, that's a good idea. Oh, you can teleport back. That's what he was doing. Can you? Yeah, he just teleported back. Oh, I. Okay. All right, that we're learning. No, because you also can't do that in a ramp. Um, yeah. I wonder if I should get another Duran's blade and one health pot. The health pot do. is definitely going to be ideal here. I'm trying to see what they buy. Yeah, he, Annie bought a bunch of health pots, and the other guy hasn't really bought anything. He just has the one ring. He does have Ignite as well. So they, they seem to have a better plan than us. Yeah, Ignite would be pretty nice. I can Did definitely the, see uh, their thought process here. I'm going to go back and, and get mana pots since we're missing Malzahar. There's no reason not to right now. All right, just got the health. Just got the health. Yeah, I guess that's good, too. We should maybe go on Ant Well, no, Malzahar is back here now. Oh man, we completely whiffed on that. <laughs> it's all right. We're making them think that we're bad. That's uh, right. that's the game plan here. Because we're not really bad. No, no. Oh, we're not. We're not bad at all. Uh oh. Watch out. Uh oh, and he's coming for me. It. All right. Thankfully, my angles are pretty elite. Just pre-pop your health pot. That's all I can say. Start having that ticking. Oh man, Malzahar is super duper low, Husky. I, I'm I'm way not over there. Throw some cards. Make it happen. Try Make it. the dream. I'm stunned. I'm stunned. No. All right. <laughs> All right. So uh, I guess it is first one to two kills. But uh, I think uh, I definitely think going for the pots is a good idea. Unless you want to really play it like super safe, then buying. I, I kind of want to do that sometime. Like go for a super macro build where you're trying to buy like super beefy items. I, uh, I feel like that would be a funny way to do it. But it does seem like going for the health pots and going for kind of the uh, – well, he was getting mana regen there. But, yeah, yeah very interesting. That is uh, that yep. is really cool. And he actually had a Blasting Wand too, which is, uh, which is really, really cool. So he had a Blasting Wand? They were uh, – he, uh, he had 32 creep scores. So they, they definitely went for oh uh, for kind of a buy strategy, which is really cool. So I really like this mode, guys. Uh, we'll probably be playing more of it. I think it's a ton of fun. And uh, any last words, Invicta? Uh, we're, we're terrible. We were bad. We're bad. But, hey, at least we won the one where we had no idea what we were doing, which I feel yeah, like. Yeah, I, I, I think that our best defense is being just completely uh, ignorantly blissful of the fact that uh, we have no idea what we're doing. That's our greatest strength, I think. And that's a, that new mode is definitely a lot of fun. 
And uh, I think we should get back at it. All right, cool, cool. Hope you guys enjoy it. Go follow us on Victor. I'll put his link down below. And, uh, of course, I'll see you guys next time. Someone? Is that? Uh, okay, they yep, banned Annie, which is good. I, I'm really bad at Annie, so that's good for us. Uh, let's see. I definitely would ban uh, he Heimerdinger. Would be would be quite scary. A Kali would be pretty, uh, pretty intense. Um, Ari well, as well would be pretty bad. There's a lot of. I mean, in the in the showdown, it's two v two, so we've got a lot of choices. All right. Well, uh, I apparently I accidentally clicked Darius, so that's who we get. <laughs> no Darius. No Darius. No, no Darius for anybody. They can't actually see them anyway. I know. I know. It's fine. It's <laughs> fine. That uh, that text is for a chat. Uh, really, what I what I was trying to say this whole time this is why I got distracted. Is there is a new mode that uh, is currently? Wait, is this? Do am oh, I banning another one? Oh my Ash. god. Yeah, this is this is the last ban for so It's because I spelled me. Ari wrong. That's what happens. Uh, they did ban Ash, which makes me really, ban really Akali. sad. Ban Akali. Akali would be pretty bad. I think. You think so? We're, we are showing our newbiness by not knowing, like, we're probably missing the most obvious. But, yeah, Akali would be pretty awful. Yeah, we're banning all the melee characters, man. They, they, we're, we're let, oh, they banned Teemo. All right. They insta banned Teemo. Okay. Yeah, so it's they my were, turn to pick. All right. Uh, well, I gotta, I, I gotta go tried and true. I think, uh, I think my boy Jarvan is going to be, uh, is going to be pretty useful in here. I'm going to be building for tank. So, yeah. That's oh, God, who should I pick? They don't give you any time. Uh, Pick uh, well. You like your Caitlyn, and you right. like we're gonna go with Graves. We're going Graves. Yeah, Graves would be good. So we got Kale and Shin Zhao. Uh, Kale is probably going to be a pretty decent choice here as well. Now, uh, as Husky was talking about, this is the brand new game mode here in League of Legends called the Snowdown Showdown, and we are doing, of course, the two v two queue. There's also a one v one queue. It's basically two v two on in the one lane map, which is called Howling Abyss. You may also know it as Aram uh, for the Aram games, and I think it's just a, it's just straight up two v two, and whoever. Whoever Nexus's die loses, I think, anyway. This is going to be the, actually the first time me and Husky have ever even seen this mode, at least for me. I don't know about you, Husky. Yeah, no, I haven't. I haven't clicked it at all. I just started hitting recording. Uh, or, I just started by hitting record, and I was like, oh, God, we have to pick these things in, like, 10 seconds. I was not prepared uh, at all for that. So that's why that was kind of lulzy. But, uh, yeah, uh, Riot's been doing these kind of fun modes very, very sporadically and for very a very short amount of time. I think the last one was only, like, a week or something like that, uh, which was a lot of fun. That was kind of the mono battles version so this is gonna be my first time playing this i don't even know how much gold you start with i don't know what the countdowns i don't know if there's minions i i don't know it's gonna be interesting obviously i didn't know about the banning because that could have gone a little <laughs> bit better but uh really i don't think i would have banned the two champions they picked anyway so i feel like uh we're, we're just fine there but i i have no idea how this gonna shape up i don't know what the balance of this is like at all so i have no experience this is gonna be we're we are gonna be 2v2 virgins invicta yeah i Hello, everyone. This is HUS Husky here, and uh, I'm here with some Victor really quickly. What's going on, man? Hey, what's up, Husky? It's your turn to ban, and we have to take away champions that we don't want anyone playing. Oh, God, who should I ban? Uh, well, we really don't want to be playing against, like, Fiddlesticks or... Yeah, Fiddlesticks would be my first choice for ban here, and they're going to ban, and then you get to ban another one, so... Uh... I'm th trying to think of champions. Heimerdinger would, would be pretty scary. Akali would also be pretty bad. So I would say Akali would be a, a good choice for a ban here. And then uh, lastly and not leastly, phew, I don't I don't know I don't know who I'd pick as the third ban. God, if only I could just ban everyone and they didn't get a go against. Uh, <laughs> wait, did they not ban?